Hey there, geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to disable game recording and broadcasting in Windows 10. If you didn't know, it's all part of Game DVR, the Xbox app. Let's you record, share games, screenshots, etc. If you don't use it, let's get rid of it. First thing you want to do, and look for the little eye up here in the video description for a link to this page. And you want to click here to disable game recording and broadcasting. It brings you to this page. Click download now. Once you've done that, you'll have three files. Enable, disable, and a link to the tutorial should you need it later. You want to do it yourself. So as we like to say in New York, you want to do this the hard way or the easy way. So we're going to do it the easy way first. So just double click disable. Click run. Click yes. Once again, click yes. And finally, click OK. And as you can see, that will disable it completely. You can't find this stuff in the settings. So once again, to reverse it and you change your mind, we're going to do the enable registry file. And it does the exact same thing. Just a couple of click, 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 and you're out. That's it. Unless you decide you want to do it the hard way. We can do it in the registry editor. So we're going to copy this code right here. And you probably don't have the game DVR key anymore. So we're going to stop right here at Windows. So go ahead and highlight that. Press your Windows key plus R. Let's do reg edit R E G E D I T. Press OK. Click yes to open the registry editor. Let's put it in. Hit enter. And as you can see, there is no game DVR. Oh, it is here. If you don't have it, you're going to have to right click on Windows. Oh, it's probably here because I played with the registry files, by the way. If you don't have it, right click here and do new key. Name that key game DVR, just like that. Capital G, capital DVR. So now that we have that key, let me get rid of the thing I was playing with. We're going to need to create a 32-bit D word value. Let me show you. Allow game DVR with a value data of zero to disable. So in other words, if you haven't done it before, we're going to right click on the right side under the game DVR. So make sure you've got this and you're clicked on the game DVR. Right click, new, D word 32-bit value. It's almost always that, not 64-bit regardless of your operating system. Control V or type in allow game capital D capital V capital R and then press enter as you can see the value data right here is zero so it's automatically should be disabled and you could probably change that to a one to enable it or just right click and delete it there you go those of you who are using Windows 10 Pro this does not work on Windows 10 home we're going to open group policy editor. We can do it there too. Windows key plus R and do gpedit.msc. It's gpedit.msc. Press OK or enter. And we're going to walk through what you see right here. So if I move a little too fast for you, just hit pause and follow this right along here. So computer configuration, add administrative templates. Windows components and we're looking for Windows game recording and broadcasting. Let me move this over again. Just, there it is right there. Windows game recording and broadcasting. As you can see there's only one setting here and that is double click it enables or disables Windows game recording and broadcasting. This is a good way to do it, again, if you have Windows 10 Pro and you're sure you want to disable it, because it takes a little bit longer to get to it, which is, again, why the registry files are available. So not configured is the default. That means it's on. And it'll tell you what you have over here as you go. So if we click on Enabled, right here, if the setting is enabled or not configured, then it's going to be allowed. So that's your default, not configured in this case. Got me a little confused there for a minute. So really the only option you want is disabled. So once you disable it, obviously it disables Windows game recording and broadcasting. And once again, you can click back to enabled or not configured. Just in case you're wondering, they're the same.
doesn't matter which one you pick. For me personally, if I go back to a default, I go back to the default setting, which in Group Policy Editor is usually not configured. So I just stick with that. And then you click OK once you've made your choice. And that's it. Again, that's a little bit harder to get to, and it's OK if you want to do it that way. But the registry files make life pretty darn simple for you. So there you have it, how to disable game recording and broadcasting in Windows 10. Bottom right hand corner is the subscribe button. Feel free to subscribe or click like or whatever you want. Thanks for watching. As always, see ya.